Hello and welcome to Frequently Asked Questions about Premiere Pro. Let me take a look at my Google search page real quick. And oh, apparently we're gonna talk about how to make subtitles in Premiere Pro. First, import your video into the timeline and make sure your clip is selected. Go to the window menu on top and find the text panel. Once it's open, you can generate captions in here. To do that, click on Create Captions from Transcript. Now this caption window will pop up. Here you can see a list of the default caption presets. You can leave it to default. In the Preferences tab, you can adjust the maximum length in character. This means how many characters there are in one subtitle. The minimum duration of how long the captions will be displayed can be adjusted as well. On the bottom, you can choose the subtitles to be in a single line or in a double line. Now let me close this tab for a second. In the second tab, you can choose the speaker's language. Or perhaps label the speakers when you have multiple people in your timeline. You can also simply select an audio track in your timeline for Premiere to transcribe or you can choose to transcribe the entire mix. When you're done, click on transcribe and create captions. It's that simple. You can now see a caption clip in the timeline and in the text panel, you can double click to adjust potential mistakes. Now, I actually have a beautiful Premiere Pro editing course for beginners where you can learn so much more detailed stuff about transcriptions. But before we get there, we will actually start with the complete basic editing techniques and build our way up to a professional video editor. All of that in just a few hours. Editing techniques custom animations, graphic and text layers, applying effects and so much more. By the end of the course you will understand the entire Premiere Pro interface and you will be 100% comfortable with using Premiere Pro. Click the link down below to level up as a video editor. And now it's time to customize some captions. To do that, go to the window menu on top and open up Essential Graphics. Now in the timeline, select all the clips you want to customize. Now in the Essential Graphics panel, you can do all the adjustments like font, size, color and so much more. For example, let's Let's give it a background. In here you can choose a color and with the settings below you can further customize the background to your liking. There you go, now you can create subtitles in just a few minutes. Next you need to learn how to use a transform effect so to continue the lesson click the video right here on my left. Thank you guys so much for watching. Stay creative.